Day Health Action Plan is a roadmap launched by the European Commission for smart and sustainable healthcare in Europe from now till 2020. To get there, research projects are fundamental, but also political leadership. Patients, doctors and nurses need to get the skills and confidence to use these technological solutions. We are all interested in the best solution for our own health and in e-health there are more opportunities to make it less costly, more agreeable and more closer to the people. So um, there is a huge interest for everybody and it is win-win. It is a win-win for ministers of finance, it is a win for the patient or the potential patient. And we are not only talking about people who are already ill, but also how could you take care of your own health. And that means that eHealth can offer you a couple of opportunities to give indeed information on the right moment and on uh, the right spot. I have many foreign patients asking for medication and when their prescription is lost or missing, this patient medicines is not always possible. Therefore, the patient must visit the doctor first. EPSOS is promising to help in my work by accessing my patient's prescriptions and by converting them to a Greek equivalent. Calistera. Yes, of course. Um, I'm coming from Italy and I need uh, a medication. Unfortunately, I do not have paper prescription. You have an ID card? Yes, I have one. I give you my um, healthcare card. The pharmacist selects the EPSOS service, which is fully integrated in the pharmacy system. Selects the country of the citizen. The pharmacist types in the data from the European Health Insurance Card. Patients' credentials are returned to the Greek National Contact Point and are forwarded to the pharmacy. The request for the e-prescription is sent by the Greek National Contact Point to the Italian one. The pharmacy system proposes the list of equivalent medicines. The pharmacist selects the medicine to be dispensed. So this is your drug. Okay, thank you. E-prescriptions are a cost-effective and a safer way to get the medicines you have been prescribed at home when you are abroad. But in case you get sick suddenly, Doctors abroad can access your medical records in order to give you a better diagnosis. There are a couple of arguments who say it should be done now and not wait for it. Number one, we in Europe are facing an aging population. The baby boom uh, is getting older and older and is closer to uh, the aging part uh, that is, uh, in most cases, more aware how important health is. Technology can help to stay healthy and independent at home without long trips to see the doctor and could avoid waiting lists for therapies to aid recovery. HeartCycle is a project that provides solutions for chronic disease management, uh, more specifically for uh, patients suffering of a cardiac condition. So what we have developed is a solution that allows these patients to follow these rehabilitation programs at home. This way they don't have to go to the hospital to follow this rehabilitation program and the uh, other, other side they feel safe for doing all these um, rehabilitation. The system itself uh, monitors uh, the patient while, while they are doing exercise with a sensor like this that is embedded on a, on a cert. And while they are doing exercise, it provides recommendations and feedback, continuous feedback that is personalized depending on how they are progressing. And this is just an example. So Look at the millions of people downloading apps to track their health and well-being. So uh, people with dementia would like to have structure and, uh, every day. CarePlan Mobile is a smartphone planning application that provides a structure and helps people with early stage dementia for complete everyday tasks. We presented our solution called VitaDoc, where we have four different measurement devices and we attach them to the iPhone. This project produces devices that, connected to your phone, become a tool for healthcare. For example, a thermometer, but also blood glucose meter for diabetics. It doesn't only inform you at the moment, but also store and manage your data for future reviews. This is my digital tool, so to say. It is just showing me if I did enough exercise and with my type of 
um, job. Um, I'm staying uh, quite often in my office and um, or sitting in a chair for meetings and what have you. So um, it is quite important that there is still a bit of exercise. And this is showing me how much I'm using from my energy, how m many steps, um, how many cal calories. So uh, this is just one of those issues, but there are a lot of instruments that are easy to handle, can uh, give you information about your blood pressure, about your heart, and name it. But e-health opportunities are not restrictive to digital users. Telehealth solutions allow patients to manage chronic conditions from their home, providing safe, convenient and cost-effective care. The European Innovation Partnership on Active and Healthy Aging will bring telehealth solutions to almost 2 million Europeans across 20 regions of Europe. Achieving the Health Action Plan means rethinking our traditional ways of providing healthcare in Europe as it puts Patients at the centre allows a more cost-effective healthcare and at the same time provides good opportunities for business in Europe.